The bombing of Romania in World War II comprised two series of events, until August 1944, Allied operations, and, following the overthrow of Ion Antoinescu's dictatorship, operations by Nazi Germany. The primary target of Allied operations was Ploiesti, the major site of Romania's oil industry. The largest refinery there, Astra Romana, processed 2 million short tons 1 t of petroleum a year, providing much of the fuel for the German military. Other attacks were against Bucharest, the country's capital. Topic 1941. The first airstrikes against Romania occurred after Romania joined the Third Reich in June 1941 during their invasion of the Soviet Union. In the following two months, Soviet air forces conducted several attacks against the King Carol I bridge, destroying one of its spans and damaging an oil pipeline, CZ Vano project. However, after the successful Axis powers Crimean campaign and overall deterioration of the Soviet position, Soviet attacks against Romania ceased. Topic 1942-1943. The United States Army Air Forces (USAAF) first dropped bombs on Romania on the 12th of June 1942 during the HALPRO Halverson Project raid against Ploiesti, the first U.S. mission against a European target. 13 B-24 Liberator heavy bombers under the command of Col. Harry A. Halverson from Fayed, Egypt dropped eight bombs into the Black Sea, two onto Constanza, six onto Ploiesti, six onto Tizani, and several onto Choflysini. In all, three people were killed and damage was minor. The bombing of Ploiesti on 1 August 1943 Operation Tidal Wave was a far more serious affair. Tidal Wave heavily damaged four refineries and more lightly affected three, it damaged the Ploiesti rail station but did not have much impact on the city itself. Campina was more severely damaged. 660 American aircrew were killed or captured, while petroleum exports exceeded pre-tidal wave levels by October. 1944 Anglo-American bombers first attacked Bucharest on 4 April 1944, aiming mainly to interrupt military transports from Romania to the Eastern Front. Lasting for two hours, the operation destroyed hundreds of buildings and killed or injured over 5,000 people according to unofficial statistics. Following King Mihai I's 23 August coup against Antonescu, the Luftwaffe retaliated from 23 to 25 August, and destroyed several buildings in Bucharest until their base just north of the city in Otopini was itself bombed by the USAAF and RAF. 